update as to what all's going on. Uh, I'm gonna do some shout outs. Been a long day. Um, had physical therapy again today. Had a bunch of running around we had to do. And got home. Uh, there goes a yellow jacket or something. And uh, just had a bunch of stuff to do around here. So I got, uh, got a little bit done as far as uh, setting up the pegs. These are some of the more common ones that I use. Uh, the common stuff I reach for all the time. I'm always looking for like, you know, damn, where's the scraper? And so, or, or the little wire brushes and stuff like that. Those are common uh, uh, spanners or wrenches all the way up to three quarter, I think. Those are the more common stuff. And then I got a duplicate set in right there that I can pull up. So. It's going okay, and I've got bags of tools that I'm kind of going through and looking at and putting them in different places, so it's kind of a process weeding it all out. But, I'm going to spin you around do some shout-outs, people that have subscribed and uh, shared the videos. Uh, as always, oh, Sulphur City Designs, uh, for all your off-road mower mudding, modding and stickage needs, bunch of good guys, custom work t-shirts hoodies um i may bring out some of the other uh stickers and decals that he's made for me southern off-road moors on facebook man we're growing post some junk or not we love it when you do jerry mcgee thanks for subscribing man i really appreciate that tom caldwell and uh tom fortin thank you sir thank you guys for uh subscribing that's great i appreciate it uh, Jordan Skillen and Corey Scott, thanks for sharing the videos uh, to everybody else. Joseph Hedden and Matthew32, thanks for sharing as well. Rob's Pack and Shine, Nate Wilson99, he's a sharing monster, Nate is. Thanks for sharing, guys. Jim Rawlings, Jim is too. Thanks for sharing, Jim. And Jordan Skillen, thanks for sharing all those videos, guys. I'll be damned. There's a damn cat. Speaking of being damned, there's a damn cat. Hey, Edward show off anyway guys over here at the uh, Cub Cadet I was gonna go ahead and throw this starter on and see if we can get it to uh, at least bump over good and quick uh, today I don't have a whole whole lot of time left uh, in the day I'll go ahead and disconnect it and I'll get a couple of wrenches and we'll see if this guy will at least uh, turn over okay, guys, now, who knows? More we're back got it bolted on those are half inch bolts going in there. Nothing too terrible. Uh, but the terrible news is that my jump box is about, only got about a half a charge on it. Well, we're just doing a spin just to see if it'll do something. That's right. That's not too bad at all. I'll charge this jump box up this evening and uh, we'll put a little gas to it. I've unhooked it uh, because, uh, well, no, I'm not saving anything on there. I mean, I'll pull the wire and harness and all that good crap. All that's going to be is a platform to crank it uh, and get it running. And uh, who knows, maybe tomorrow uh, we will try to uh, get that where it will crank uh, at least. And that way we can find out if it smokes and if the transaxle moves. If the transaxle moves, I can sell the transaxle. And uh, if the uh, motor smokes, it'll kind of let me know what I can do, uh, what I'm going to be able to do with it. So, hang on, more to come. Got some news, too. Hold on. Got the jump box on charger. It'll charge overnight. Have a full charge. And uh, worst comes to worst, I'll jump it off of the car also if I need to. Uh, I broke down, and I was able to get another uh, camcorder. Uh, it is an exact duplicate of the one I cracked. Uh, I like those. It's a it's a Samsung uh, pocket cam uh, just for like doing uh, stuff like this, the videos like this. Uh, I like these, and then uh, you know the GoPros and uh, uh, point of view ones uh, for the other stuff. Uh, those are good. But this one, um, waterproof, dustproof, shockproof. Uh, it's got good anti-vibration software, which is great because this one's about gone, and this will go back to being my backup. Um, and uh, this one. Uh, the new one will also be able to put on a tripod, so I know a lot of y'all be happy about that, and you won't be seeing all the shaky videos. Did want to mention before we uh, wrap up everything for today, Mike Mayerin just put uh, band brakes on his uh, uh, ramp mower. Uh, you got to go take a look at his video. Uh, if I can figure out how to post a link, 
I'll do that. Um, he got it finished and uh, it does great. He called me earlier today. Uh, Mike, sorry, I couldn't catch it because we were out uh, running around all day. Uh, but I'll give you a call tomorrow. Um, but man, it's a good video. Congratulations. It looks really good and it works great. That's it for me, guys. I'm going in the house. About whooped. I think we're having hoagies. Hot hoagie sandwiches. Little, you know, the sub sandwiches. Thanks for watching, guys. Thanks for sharing. Thanks for all your comments. Comment away. Uh, and if somebody says something that's interesting uh, and they were talking to me, by all means, jump into it. Uh, it it's good to uh, uh, carry the conversations around. That's what the channel's for. Y'all gonna make some mayhem, guys.